We've installed some um, water refill stations. The machine's been in for two weeks now, and in that short space of time, we've effectively avoided the need for over a thousand plastic bottles. More and more public places will, will, will install this, this sort of piece of equipment. Here we are. But we've decided to tackle plastic because we really should. You know, as a responsible developer, um, it's something that we can do. Um, you know, we can put the infrastructure in place to, to you know, to, to make a difference and, and that's what we're doing here. When we set the, um, the machines up, we reckoned that they, we'd save about 100,000 bottles a year. Um, we're going to have seven of these machines installed in, on the estate and if every one of them performs like this one, um, I can't do the maths, but I think we're going to well exceed that target of 100,000 bottles. And there's another machine over there as well, isn't there, that does a slightly different task? Yeah, that's, um, that's for those people who have plastic bottles that they want to dispose. We've installed a reverse vending machine. And um, people can come along with the bottle, place it in the machine, and they will get a credit. It's one of the first um, publicly available reverse vending machines in the UK. I just want to make the point on this. We're not banning things. We're not saying, you know, these, these plastics are, are wrong, we can't use them. What we're advocating here is a more responsible approach to plastics. You know, it's, some plastics are necessary. We're not saying ban plastics, but what we're saying is let's think about our use of plastics and let's think about, especially the single-use plastics, let's think about how we use them, but more importantly, how we dispose of them. It's about being responsible.